In today's video, we look at another Omid Jalili sketch where he depicts a Polish person perfectly, hopefully. Uh, you guys will have to tell me how well he does. It is very funny, so like and subscribe, and let's check it out. But we've come up with a new motto for Britain. Uh, would you like a little preview before 2012? Yes. The new motto for Britain is, Welcome to Poland. <laughs> Over here, there are a lot of Poles that have come over, and I think it's awesome. It's awesome. Quite often, they do jobs better than, than the English people do, so I've got no problem. Um, I do wish that the Poles would open up and not be such a closed group. That's the only one thing I would, I would like to see happen. Now, now do you see what I did there? Do you see what I did there? I was clearly being racist. <laughs> But the people I'm being racist about are white, so you can't do nothing about it! <laughs> That's so true. Who said, you're being racist? I said, about who? Those white people over there? Well, which one in particular? I don't know, they all look the same to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, are there any Polish people here at all? One, there's one Polish person. Okay. That's interesting. I asked the same question Warsaw last week. Nothing. <laughs> Not a single poll. <laughs> boss. Hello, boss. I finish. Well, you finished already? I fixed showers in changing room. All fixed. But you've only been ten minutes. I'm sorry it takes so long. Oh, I hope you're on a proper job. I know what you lot are like. Proper job. <laughs> Funny, yeah. Batman. I don't understand why he keeps going Batman. He did that in the last one. If anyone understands, please tell me in the comments. I don't understand why he keeps saying Batman. Uh, but there is that whole thing of they get the job done. But I think in England, you get this whole rhetoric of, oh, these Polish people um, are coming over, stealing our jobs, when they're jobs that people didn't want to do in the first place. But anyway. Yeah. Well, you got an invoice for me then? Oh, yes, invoice. Wait one moment. I get back. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> I get invoice. Bloody hell, mate. Where did you learn to run like that? I would say maybe it's just a case of poles are quick. Uh, but if you're a man... Uh, you probably don't want to be classed as being quick, if, if that makes sense to anyone, <laughs> if you've got a dirty mind. Oh, this is an internment camp. I run mile in three minutes, but I run much faster with dogs behind me. <laughs> Batman. Yeah, right. Who is running man? He's only the British 100 meter champion. You tell him to give me a call if he want radiators fixed. <laughs> It's fantastic because, look, I know Omid Jalili, he's Iranian. He's a comedian and, and he does impersonations really well. Um, but what he does, and I think actually this picks up on the, the British humour, um, the Polish humour that I'm learning about now, is that we can take the mick out of ourselves, right? We can t take the mick out of each other. And the running joke here is, well... We were basically encamped and chased by dogs. Uh, it, it's ridiculous. And it could be seen as being offensive to some people, I'm sure. But if we can take the mick out of ourselves and, and each other, then we're less sensitive to it. It's not like we're forgetting. It's not like we're not remembering these things. But sometimes it's not good to necessarily uh, dwell and be too sensitive on these issues. Wasted in this country. <laughs> <laughs> but we all know the sad thing is lots of Polish people are going back to Poland now. And I think as British people, we feel really aggrieved by this. You know, people say, send the Poles back to Poland. They are, they're all going in their droves. Oh, was it something we said? <laughs> no, don't go away, come back. 
That's so true. That's so true. You know, look, if you are Polish or any kind of another from another country and you, you know, you've got people that come over to England, we are not all these racist, nationalist people. We're not all that horrible. Okay. The problem is there are people like that that will say, oh, you're stealing our jobs. Get, go back to your own country. And it's awful. It is awful that people are like that. Because as I said, you know, these Poles that are coming over to England are doing such good work, doing jobs that, for example, English people won't be doing. Um, and they're doing it at a, at a high standard. You know, there are, there are people, for example, that I've now learned about that, are coming over from Poland from university degrees and are and are and are doing a job levels below and I'm not saying it's it's less valuable but I'm saying it's level levels below what the education standard is um and they're doing a bloody good job at it so I want to apologize for all those idiots those knobheads that are basically ignorant basically they're ignorant um, but like I said, it's so good that, you know, we can take the mick out of ourselves. Look, Omar Jalili, as I said, he's Iranian and he's taken the mick out of Brits. He's taken the mick out of, of Polish people in this sketch. He's throughout all his, his comedy, he takes the mick out of different nationalities and it plays on those stereotypes. And I'm sure, look, he's overdone it, obviously, with the whole speed of, of how quick Polish people get jobs done. Of course he's overdone it. But it's playing on those stereotypes. And quite often, comedy is playing on those stereotypes. If you think about, especially old school British humour, it's taking the mick out of, you know, when you look at Some Mothers Do Have Them, it's, it's thinking about the, the calamitous English person um, that, you know, is clumsy, is, is just... But it's those stereotypical things, you know? Um, and I think you've got to embrace those stereotypes. I embrace the fact that I'm grumpy. There you go. Um, another great sketch. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please do like this video down below and then hit that subscribe button to join for some more fun videos like this, some educational videos, and we'll have a good time. I'll catch you next time.